Kom ons kyk. Reg, en soos ons reeds dit nou al reeds be, benadruk het, mens het nie van die chimpansee of die gorilla ontwikkel nie. And I think molecular evidence has pointed out that our line has divided from them about 8 million years ago and that we could see with a phylogenetic tree. So waar heen of waar is, wat, wat is wetenskapelikus besig om te soek na? Dit was ons soek na na die gemeenskapelike voorouwer vir mense, chimpansees, gorillas en dit sal altyd aan die gang blij tot ek onzeker tevrede is ons het iets gevind wat vir ons um, tevrede sal stel. En ja, ons DNA is 98,6% diezelfde as die van een chimpansee. En um, that slide I couldn't help myself by just showing you this slide, chimps and humans, how small can a change be? And I hope you do recognize the person next to the chimp. Of course, that is Charles Darwin. So it's more than 98, to be exact, 98,6% similar. En ons het al reeds vir julle in die eerste kwartaalse wink met, met vraagstel eense inhoud gesê dat indien daar geen bloed in die bloedbank uh, betrok of sal wees nie, dan kan jy seker maar as jy kan sê, is die bloed gebruik. Mm. En, en bewys en wetenskapelike bewys het toon dat het wel so is. Wat maak dan vir ons dat ons dan hier die unieke eigenskappe het wat nie in Afrika ape gevind word nie? First of all, we are always always on two feet. Ons is altyd bipedal. We are bipedal and this has led to certain adaptations in our behavior. We have a large and highly developed brain and this has led us to make use of tools, very complicated and intricate tools and of course there's sexual dimorphism and we can definitely distinguish between male and female. We are omnivores, we can eat whatever we want, so we can live in a variety of habitats, we can move around where it suits us. We have much less body hair, that means that thermoregulation should take place, and this is not visible in any fossil, that it, it can't be visible in fossils. And um, I wonder if they can still remember what thermoregulation is, but um, I think the teachers will assist them because it's working from previous years. Mm. And then we have a highly developed language center and that makes that we can have certain cultural practices and we can adapt to very severe conditions. Um, before you go on to the next slide, Colin, I think it's important that you shall want to talk about the fact that what it means that the human being always always rechtop loop. Ja. En die veranderingen wat het teweeg gebring het, en mense nie net in ons bouw en hoe ons lyk en gedrag nie, maar dit is een hele reeks veranderingen wat die hele paar dinge moendlik gemaakt het. En hierdie laaste feit, um, ons, ons hoogst ontwikkelde taalcentrum, ons gaan daarna ook verwijs hierdie kultuurpraktijken, want dit het ook sekere dinge in ons ontwikkeling moendlik gemaakt. So kom ons kyk, um, jylle het hierdie skuifie ook in, die, in Afrikaans en in Engels in jylle uitdeelstukke, daar gaan dit verder. So there's quite a few, you can compare homo sapiens with the other primates, and it can also be a longest question, so go and have a look. And um, this table, in Afrikaans as well as in English, in your notes. Yeah, and just the fact that we're running through it, that doesn't mm. mean that you need, uh, needn't pay attention to that. It's very important that you mm. know similarities as well as differences. Ja, en dit was maar net ook een herhaling ja. en dinge wat ons reeds bespreek en nog na gaan verwijs. So, ek wil by Karin aansluit, mm. jylle moet baie mooi kyk en seker maak, dat jylle gaan weet hoe kom verskil ons as mense dan nou van die primate. Dat is twee dinge. Mm. Hoe kom is ons die selfde? Hoe kom word ons as primate mm. beskou? Maar ook, hoe verskil ons van die primate? We moet nie dier mekaar raak nie, want daar is baie, uh, um, ek sal maar sê, verwarrende dinge, as jy, jy kan dalk primaat kenmerke en uitsluitlik menselike kenmerke, wees versichtig dat jy nie dier mekaar raak nie.